All right, so it's a beautiful spring day in Columbia, Missouri. It's around one o'clock in the afternoon. And this is Dinosaurs and Cavemen Science Expo with help from uh, Integrative Anatomy, the Department of Geology, Anthropology. This is the Midwest Missouri Astronomical Society parked out front here. You can see they have a number of big telescopes. This big white one here, they're actually pointed at a football that's like, I don't know, way out there towards the road that you can see. This, this telescope over here is actually pointed up at the sun. It's got a red filter, and so you can kind of look up at the sun. Oh, that hurts. All right. So let's go ahead and walk inside here. Here's the main entrance. And here we hit the circus. So here's where you can check in for the planetarium. Very nice. Up front, here we go. Dinosaurs and cavemen. So what you can do is you can kind of come right up in here. You can grab yourself a paleo passport book. I don't know the answer. And inside the paleo passport book, there's all sorts of stuff like this. So as we walk around through here, when you leave, there's Jill. Hi, Jill. You can pick up some IA literature if you want. You can fill out a, a survey. All right. If you fill out, if you fill out your awesome. your passport, you can get cool little Chinese-made dinosaurs <laughs> or or brains or tattoos because we're all about the ink here. All right. And so as you walk in, here's the tool making area here. And so you can see some anthro and other folks making various types of tools. You come over here. And here's our mapping a dig site. And so here you can see where you're basically mapping. It looks to be a bear. I don't know where the bear came from. Ohio or Maybe Ohio. This actually might be the uh, West Virginia bear that we have. All right. That's pretty cool. Hi, Matt. You come over here. We're hawking some t-shirts. Talking about what we're doing in the news. And then here's the trackway. There's Libby, Dr. King. Dr. Middleton with our nice little footprints here. And obviously, as you can see, we're leaving lots of trace fossils in the paper over here, right? So back across the way, I mean, look at this place, it's crazy. Over here, we have some more dig boxes, and I believe we can find some velociraptors in here, right? Velociraptors, whoa, pretty cool. All right, so here's geology. So geology showed up and brought real fossils. So we have footprints, trilobites, a sunflower coral, ooh, some plant, that's cool. But this is the bomb right here. So there's our mammoth humerus, and it's, it's for shizzle right here, dude. That's the real thing, all right? With an allosaurus humerus for scale, right, geology? Ooh, geology, all right. And they got more stuff over here. It's crazy. So here's more geology. This is all ancient Missourians. Now we move into the age of crocodiles, where we have things on loan, like Plosasuchus, various crocodiles and alligators. And we move our way over to extinction survivors. And here's Holiday Lab student Kinsey Jacoby. More Holiday Lab stuff with birds are dinosaurs. You see Archaeopteris, Confucius Ornus. Henry's working the T-Rex table. Look at all this Tyrannosaur stuff. There's Ian. Working the Tyrannosaurs. Woo! Look at this crowd. So this is about right before the queue for the planetarium show starts up again. Over here we have Little Lasco. We can basically do some cave art. We got stencils and crayons and all sorts of things like that. Okay. And over here we have Make Your Own Human Skeleton. Look at the crowds, oh my gosh, crowds everywhere. Crowds everywhere. Oh no, that kid's getting eaten by Stancast, oh my gosh. Over here we have the Who Am I table, where everybody can kind of come up with various questions and identify which skulls they have in front of them. Kind of like a mix and match activity. Over here we have a virtual archeology span site with iPad apps, things like that. There's Stephanie working the table right on. Over here we have our 3D printer and meet Shield Croc, where we can show how we can CAT scan, 3D print, and make 3D PDFs of models of things. Hey, what's up, Shield Croc? Oh, check that out. That's really cool. Oh my gosh, what is that? Ooh, clear and stain alligator. And here we have a laser scanner showing how we can scan things and bring them up on the computer to make these 3D files. Very cool. And finally, well, here's the hominid table. So lots of monkey people, fish monkeys, right? 
All right, look at all this stuff. Yeah, a little scary. Woo! All right, look at all these hairy people. We don't shave much in Missouri. Very nice. And there we are. So that basically caps what Dinosaurs and Cavemen has going on this year. And we'll maybe we'll see you again next year. Thank you very much.